Right now, as I speak, millions and millions of drivers are saving money on their car insurance with GEICO. If you're one of those drivers, well done. If you're not, it's easy to join them. Visit GEICO.com today. Joining us on the line is this unsung hero from 2003 in Washington State, Kyle Bosler. Kyle Bosler, welcome to the show. You're on with Bruce and Mark. Hey, thanks, guys. How y'all doing? Uh, doing great. So, you know, you, you look at a basketball game, and Michael Jordan, you know, he gets hot. He cannot miss. Or Kobe Bryant gets hot. He cannot miss. So that night, back in 2003, with your punt, were you just feeling it that night? Uh, it was kind of a, yeah, it's kind of a thing where, you know, some people say when you kind of go not so much unconscious, but you're, everything just seems to click. And that was definitely a game that, 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 that definitely did, and it one that we needed it to. So I was just fortunate that I could contribute more so than just being the guy that no one wants to see come in. Uh, Kyle, this is Bruce Binkowski. Now, I'm the executive director, so when they came to me and they said, we're going to announce right after the game that the punter is going to be the defensive MVP, I've got to admit I was a little bit skeptical that I thought, I don't know how people are going to react. So my question to you is, since I was skeptical, what did you think – when the announcement was made that you were the defensive MVP, I was I was halfway off the field. So wherever where, where they had the podium, I was at the other like ten yard line, far away, and I was walking off and you know just celebrating the win in general. And someone grabs me by my jersey, I think from the media department at Washington State. And he goes, "Hey, they want you up here." I'm like, "For what?" And they said, "Well, you're the defensive MVP." I'm like. I totally thought they were messing with me, so I was right on board with you. So I was more excited about the win and thought they were pulling my chain. But well, I, I got to yeah. tell you, Kyle, when uh, it came from the press uh, up in the press box, and there's a couple of media people that will that will ask about uh, who should be the the MVPs, and and one of them was so adamant that it had to be you, and I had the same reaction as Bruce. But then when we looked at the stats, it was kind of a no brainer. What now? You were excited about the honor, obviously. What did your teammates think? Uh, you know, I to tell you the truth, I don't. I mean, they were very excited, uh, especially the defensive guys were because, you know, that always puts them at an advantage when the ball is down and they have to go, you know, 80-plus yard, yards. And so, um, you know, they were just thrilled and couldn't believe it that a punter won an award. And we were, we were both on the same page, but it was more about the win over Texas than – individual. So. We're talking to Kyle Bosler, the punter for the 2003 Washington State Cougars. Washington State beat Texas 28-20 to in the Holiday Bowl that year, and Kyle was our defensive most valuable player. Uh, Mark, you, you've, uh, we've already informed Kyle of his big uh, honor coming up. Do you want to reiterate it or shall well, yeah, we? Well, can we break some news yeah, here? Go ahead. This, is, this is big news because this is a first in oh. San Diego Bowl Game Association history. Yep. And as we mentioned to Kyle yesterday, that Kyle will be the next inductee in the next class of inductees for the San Diego Bowl Game Association's Hall of Fame. Congratulations, Kyle. Thank you guys very much. I'm, I'm very privileged and honored to be a part of the class. So when, when uh, you got that, that notification yesterday, did you, have you received any awards like this recently? Did you think that this was a, did you even think this was possible? No, totally thought I was lying. I almost fell out of my truck on my way home. He told me, but, you know, it's definitely something that still hasn't sunk in. I mean, to be the Hall of Fame, I think, of anything is, is definitely an honor. And I'm just fortunate that I was, I was selected. So Now, Kyle, yeah. you, you finished your career at uh, Washington State. And uh, forgive me, I don't have all the stats in front of me. What was that? Was that your senior year, junior year in 03? Um, that was my red shirt sophomore year. Oh, so good you, one, Bruce. I'm glad you did. Yeah, the I did all my preparation. Uh, what happened? How was the rest of your career, and where'd you go from there? Um, after after college, I signed with the Cleveland Browns as a free agent. Um, played through the preseason with them. Was released. Got signed again in January. Played in the last season of NFL Europe. Over for the Frankfurt Galaxy. Um, Ended up tearing all the cartilage in my punting leg due to blocked punts. And then I was signed under Cleveland at that time, so I was on IR for 
the remainder of the season, I was out for an entire year with two knee surgeries and rehab. So that ended football real quick. Real quickly, Kyle, uh, jumping back to your, your trip to San Diego in 2003, we really take pride in, in how we treat the student athletes at our game. What memories do you have of coming to San Diego and, and Bowl Week? Not the game so much, but the Bowl Week. Oh, I thought the Bowl Week was great. Along, you know, with the events, the big, the beef bowl, uh, just kind of the way it was organized. I mean, nothing against any of the other bowls that we had been to, but I think just the way it was organized, the way they allowed fans, family, to kind of be close to their children or um, whoever their favorite player, just to be a fan, I think the city of San Diego and also the bowl committee did a phenomenal job with just how courteous they were to all of us. Well, Kyle Bosler, a truly an unsung hero for the San Diego Bowl Game Association and his Washington State Cougars in 2003. Thanks so much for joining us. and We look forward to seeing you at our Hall of Fame induction luncheon next year. Great. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a good weekend.